Alice has a manuscript that's due really soon. Everyone at the agency is getting a bit nervous. I mean, I haven't seen a manuscript. Have you seen the manuscript? I have not seen a manuscript. For years now, she's been hinting that she's revisiting one of her characters, so I've booked her on the Queen Mary 2 with her two friends and her nephew. Here's to picking up the conversation where we left off. And here's to reconnecting the gang of three who we used to be. <laughs> Did you always talk like that? I'm going to start work on my manuscript. Swim at three, dinner at seven, back to work or bed or both. I'll probably work in bed. I kind of feel like I'm spending time with three almost like Dinosaurs. No. <laughs> you believe Alice and her book determined your whole life? The consequences on my life of her actions were unacceptable. You want to go have a drink later? No, I can't. I just don't know who you are anymore. Does anybody trust you? We really lost each other. How's work going? Ah, oh, I've hit a wall. Well, maybe you should so, take a breather. Sometimes the sources that a writer uses are very close to home. There is a lot of excitement. Is there anything you might be able to share with us? Not really, not at this point, no. Whatever character I write about is essentially about me. That's a little pompous. Who is the real you? Where's Tyler? He has a date, an older woman. <laughs> How much older? Like in her 80s? Oh. <laughs>